Hello and welcome back, you lovely people. Today we're looking into what's called EMB series, which is a shading tweak to get more realistic colours and shades on your FSX. Uh, to be quite honest with you, I use it myself I've only as a test and uh, I don't see a great difference. There is a difference, but not a very big difference because it, it says on it, as I have read, your graphics card makes the final decision on how your graphics looks anyway. So with me using one of the top graphics cards, I don't think uh, I see much difference. But if you're using a lower lower model or etc., it might be worth a go because I've heard numerous things and a lot of other members have used this and say it looks great and I've seen some pictures and it does look great. So it might be good for you. And if it doesn't work, then just go back to normal. It's very easy to take off. So the first thing you need to do is download the little pack for the eBay series. So I'll put this link in the in the description of the video but here it is okay download it to your downloads go into your downloads Ooh. go into your downloads okay mb series for fsx just right click extract here and it goes to the folder there it is so first one to do we'll do the water okay so find your main fsx file let's get this out of here right click Cut. Come out of that. Minimize that. New folder. Paste. Okay. Okay. So the first thing we we're going to do is the water. So right click, cut, or copy. Doesn't matter. Copy. These have to go in your main FSX root. So if we go to desktop, yours will be in your probably your program files, Microsoft games, FSX, mine's in computer d drive fsx okay and it just needs to go in here but before you pull it in here keep a copy of your old one in case you don't want to use this mod no more so it's there so just drag it to somewhere you want it so you know where it is mine's there and go paste replace the file in the destination yes okay that's that one done next one Ooh. where's my other there it is next two is just these pair and that's it right click copy go back to your fsx main folder right click paste they don't replace anything they just get put in there so that's it come out of that that's done open up your fsx this here this is normal ignore this it's, it's no biggie just showing you that it works uh, so if we go to anywhere, let's just go to Friday Arbor. Do, 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 do. It's configured, it says there. For, oh, I didn't, didn't catch it. Anyway, okay, so we're on the FSX. And then what you have to do is you press Shift and F12. As you can see, that's on and off, on, off, on, off. Can't really tell which one's on, can't really tell which one's off, but I think that's on now. Let's have a little take off. Off. On. Off. On. Or the other way around. Yeah, that's that's how it's done, guys. It's on. I don't see much of a difference in mine, but there is a little, a little difference. But it's hard to determine which one is off and on. But that's how it's done. Check how it looks on your PCs. It looks a, a bit brighter, I must say, with it on. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching. Pretty easy to do. If you want to take it off again, all you do, come out of your FSX, go into your FSX directory, find. The ones we've just put in here, which is that one and that one, and just delete them. That's it. And then replace the water constants because that's the only one we backed up with the original. Okay, guys, if you if you find it helpful, if you if it worked for you, if you got getting decent graphics, I'd like to see the the outcome. So uh, post your pictures up on the Go Air forum or join us on the TeamSpeak. Thanks for watching. Take care and see you again.